Hi, good morning. Happy Thursday. Oh my gosh. This is like, what, the third, fourth day in a row that we've had crappy weather here in Colorado. Oh my gosh. It's supposed to be getting warmer. I don't know. But I wanted to come on here because I know I hadn't come on with this month's um, host exclusive, which I am totally loving. I have another jar on its way because I closed out another party and oh, I'm loving this. So I'm hoping to close out another party, a uh, qualifying party to get another one of these. It is so good. It takes like 10 minutes to, to steep. So I've had it steeping in here. It's got almost three minutes left. Um, but you guys, this has unpasteurized honey, cinnamon, black tea, pea pollen, natural flavors. Okay, so if you are allergic to any of those, I would not suggest this. But, oh my gosh, um, it is so good. And the, the, the cinnamon taste that's in it, I am so been loving it. Um, and it was about time for me to steep another <clears throat> cup because I just finished what I was doing this morning with my poir tea. I do that first thing in the morning. Um, oh my gosh, but this is... This is Canadian honey, so um, it's low in cholesterol, sodium free, no artificial flavors or colors, and it's got the high quality ingredients that you know and love from Steepology. Um, and along with that, this month, if you spend $65, you get this amazing little six pack of soda flavored teas. Um, I've already tried a few of these. Um, the key lime I tried last night, I'm really loving it. There are pieces of lime in here, guys. Look at this. Can you see that big piece of lime? Oh, yes. Lime and what's in here? There's Voivus tea, pineapple pieces, cinnamon chips, lime slices, cloves, canola, petals and then natural flavors. This one takes four to six minutes. Um, this is a naturally caffeine free. So yes, I love this one. I've tried that one. And then the raspberry cream soda. Oh, I heard it was a real hit. I loved it. I actually mixed it with last month's host exclusive, which was the sweet watermelon sugar matcha yesterday. For a little afternoon pick me up instead of like a monster or, or an energy drink that's what I do use is my matcha for that you can just do little shooters but that's one of the ones that are in there and this one has mango pineapple pieces again um, blueberries sunflower oil hibiscus I think that's why I really love it because I love anything with the hibiscus in it raspberry pieces uh, cal, cal, cal and dull petals. I can never say that. <laughs> but this one is a fruit tea, so it's naturally caffeine also. And then we have the cola tea. Oh, this one I really love. You, you guys, these really taste like soda. If you mix them with like a, um, with a, um, uh, a sparkling water or salsa water or something like that. Mm -hmm. So that's the timer for our our, um, our honey latte. Which I'm actually going to make as a latte too. I used just enough to cover the leaves in here uh, because it's so sticky and wet. Let me show you what it looks like. Oh, wait, let's pull this out because it is black tea in here. So. And I really don't know the science behind why you can steep it longer. I don't know, but it does not get bitter. I don't know if it's because it's coated in that. Look, it's like sticky. Oh, so much pollen in there. And then I'm going to make it that much better. I'm adding a little froth on top to make it a latte. smell of cinnamon I just love the smell of cinnamon and, and now when it's like this and cold and dreary and kind of half rain and half snow and kind of yucky mm, yeah so good so good
Okay, so, and then what else we have in here? We have Italian orange cream soda, um, which I really love if this is the same one that we had as a, no, I don't think it was because this is a fruit tea and that one was a rooibos tea um, that was out last, last summer that I got with my perfect pitcher. Um, and it was really good. I like, I didn't like it cold steeped, but I like it, I liked it hot steeped. Some things are better, um, when they're hot steeped because they enhance the flavor. So that one, the lemon, lemon ginger ale, I know I'm going to love this. I know I'm going to love this. Um, cause I think I actually, I think this is the one I had before. I don't know, but I love most of the rooibos teas. This one's a rooibos tea. And it just has the rooibos tea, ginger root, orange peel, lemon peel, and then natural flavors. And the rooibos teas you can brew twice. So that's another added bonus to that. Um, and then the creamy root beer is a green tea. This is something I want I wanna try too. And the green teas you can brew three times. So a lot of these, you can brew more than once. And I, the one I just did, I don't. But normally if I do, I will just take this whole container, stick it in the fridge, and then the next time it's ready to be brewed up. Um, and the creamy root beer, it has green tea, sarsaparilla root, sarsaparilla root. I'm thinking that's what gives it the root beer taste. Um, Cause Caladrian Petals is next, and then Natural Flavors. And like I said, um, you can brew this three times. Zero calories. Zero calories in this, guys. No sugar. Yeah. So if you wanted to add just like, um, I like co sparkling coconut water. Um, with any of these, would be crazy good. So what you would do, you know what? I'll come back on later on. Um, I'll come back tomorrow and show you how you can make these into a soda out of tea. So, you guys, oh, wait, and you also get your 50 sleeping sacks with that. So, yes, all that, um, I think it's probably like $22. Uh, you spend $65 this month. And then get with me if you want to host a party to get that cinnamon honey latte. It is so good, and um, I've noticed how much it's helped with the inflammation that my, I've been having in my knee and in my gut a little bit lately. So, yeah, um, I have a few openings coming up this week. So, happy sipping. Happy Thursday. Hope it's amazing.